Hi everyone, my name is Ahmed. I am an international student from Pakistan who has just finished his master's in management from the University of York. And today I will be telling you how I was able to manage my finances. Um, I will. I have gotten a scholarship from the University of York, which has actually helped me a lot in being able to meet both ends meet with regarding to my finances to come here in the UK and do my master's. Um, I would definitely recommend each and every single student to visit the university scholarship page and look for the scholarship that best fits their needs and apply for it. Um, many times, many students think that they won't be able to get it, but again, uh, if you don't try, you never know. Um, on top of that, I would still recommend each and every single student to still as soon as you come here um there's two things you need to do one is straight away apply for your national insurance number and set up a bank account and secondly would be to walk around the town look around the university and apply for a job um the process of setting up a, a, a bank account is that you have to go to each any bank that you want to go to whichever you want to open up for i personally went to barclays and it wasn't too much of a hard process for me you walk in with the required uh, i i'm not too sure if they require any such asset documents as long as you have your id and verification with you or um a university letter that you can actually get from the evision website if i'm not too sure but you can just double check that you can get that from the evision website um you take those documents out you go to any bank and you tell them that you want to open up a student account and i'm going to give you a pro tip if they tell you that they cannot allow you to do it because there's a lot of um, people in line that want to open up a bank account just say that you don't have if it's actually true for your behalf if you don't have any bank account in the uk then they will prioritize you and open up your bank account right away secondly a revolute is a very good source of way for you to actually get money and actually make online transactions so it's an application that's um digital bank um you can get money on your bank account from there and you can make easy online transactions um along with that i would say apply for a job either in the university or outside the university um you can work part-time for up to 20 hours you can work on either full-time on the weekends or you can work part-time throughout the entire day um, throughout the entire weekdays and you can actually manage your studies and your time at the same time um, it's it's not too hard um, as long as you give it an effort it's definitely worth the time I will tell you a pro tip on how to manage your budgets as well don't go out too much to party definitely I know uh, coming out into a foreign country you'd want to go and explore I'll say by managing your finances don't eat too much from outside try to cook as much as you can at home um, you can literally get a chicken for like three or four I'd say tops five pounds and if you cook the whole chicken you can literally have four to five meals from it easily so you won't be able to spend too much money outside I personally used to do that I used to cook at home and then I used to make lunch boxes and I used to have them throughout the entire day three or four meals easily um, that way I was able to save up a lot of money. I would 100% recommend you to download an application called Stint. Um, it's a part-time application for all the students that gives you part-time jobs that are available within the city that you are located in. These are some of the tips that I personally um, had to go through throughout the entire year to figure out. So download Stint, which is a student job application. You can get jobs easily from there once you get accepted from the application. Um, you can use Revolut as an online banking source. Um, it's a digital bank account that you can open up. On top of that, go to Barclays or any bank account and say that you're a student if you don't have any account in the uk be like you can tell them it's your first account and they will prioritize you even more and don't eat too much from outside when you can cook easily at home if you don't know how to cook youtube is your best friend youtube and google that's the only things that you need